final number one on the Red Alliance. We have three game pieces scored up top. Super Duper coming back with a second, scoring it in a low node. Blue Alliance has one game piece on a high node, one in the middle, and Galactech engaged on the Blue Alliance charge station. We've now entered Teleop. Red Alliance, 99.99, that's Cranberry Alarm, has a cube in their grip, and they dropped it into the low node. 99.92, however, on the opposing Blue Alliance, blanks a pretty tough defense up against Super Duper. It looks like the Blue Alliance has correctly identified that Super Duper is a team they need to slow down. We saw a little bit of defense from both Square Table Robotics and Galactech up against Super Duper. Blue Alliance is trailing by four points. Red Alliance has a lead with 45 to 41 with a minute and a half remaining. Blue knows they need to catch up. Roundtable Robotics scoring a cube, going back for another. They picked up with their floor intake on their claw. They just missed it in a top node, but it landed pretty close to a bottom node. Their partner, Galactech, swinging around with a cone in their gripper, looking to score it on a node for the Blue Alliance. Meanwhile, over on red, Super Duper has been trying to make it out of their protected zone, but they've got some tough defense up against our two Wisconsin defensive bots trying to slow down Super Duper on their way to their human player substations. 50 seconds remaining, Red has maintained their lead. It's now 65 to 54. 6721, our Red Alliance captain lifting up. They have a cone in their clutches, looking to score the second link. They've got it for the Red Alliance. That's actually going to be the third link for the Red Alliance. They now only need two more in order to get their sustainability bonus. It is now our end game. We have 25 seconds left. Blue still trailing. Galactech trying to help that. They've got a cone looking to score it to score the first link on the blue side. Meanwhile, on red, Tenley Trailblazers already engaged for the Red Alliance. Their partner, Super Duper, looking to come up and join them. Five seconds remaining. Square Table Robotics trying to engage for blue with their sister team. As time runs out, we have two robots engaged on red and two robots close to docking on blue. We'll keep you posted on the final score in just a moment.
we have our results for our first playoff match, and it's the Red Alliance with a score of 100 to Blue Alliance's 85. Congratulations to our number one winning Red Alliance. We'll see them face off again in the next match after this next one. See you then.